All right, hello everyone, it's Robin, and I'm back with another episode of Amori. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm working with another microphone, thanks to my boyfriend. I'm so grateful. But yeah, hopefully it's great. I don't know what else to say other than the audio might sound different just because I'm using a different microphone and I'm, I just got it literally yesterday. So I'm still experimenting with it a lot. I hope it's great. I did a lot of stuff to try to change some settings and all that, but yeah. That's where we left off. Um, we just got out of the last resort and I think we're going to go check around, what was it called? Oh, the deep well. I think we're gonna check around there for basil. We're still trying to find basil. I still need to find the ghosts for the ghost party. I still need to do a lot, a lot of quests and stuff. Oh wait, I have Aubrey now so I can, I can get some stuff. I hope we get another chance to go back to the rest of the colorful world. I feel like we should be able to because we have a lot of unfinished like side quests. I've gotten some of the things that I need for the side quest in other areas. So you would think it would make sense, but I don't know. What an incredible party. Top Hat Ghost sets the bar higher every time I owe you one. Friends, take this. What? <laughs> okay. I still think the sound that makes is really funny. Last resort, endless highway. Okay. Isn't there some kind of thing on the endless highway? Like, there was, there were people talking about there was this like shop or whatever. Um, some kind of like coffee place or, or like cafe or something. I don't know. All right, we're back here. Oh my gosh. Hey, we can get in this area now, right? <laughs> you really have three friends? Hmm. All right, all right. Let's get a move on, people. Yeah. Yeah, we do have friends. Oh my gosh, it was a snake? I didn't realize it was a snake. Maybe this is... I wasn't expecting there to be a whole key. Underwater highway. It's a whole... Oh my gosh, it's a whole thing. I am so sorry if this is laggy. Wait, what? Hey, isn't that sweetheart? What is she doing down here? Hey, sweetheart, remember us? We're the kids who almost ruined your wedding. Wow. How great, Kel. That was, that's such a, why would, why? Why would you do that? What, you for again? Are we doing this again? Are we doing this again? Why do you keep showing up? Why do you keep showing up? So, how's married life treating you? Good question. Ha, huh, married life is a joke. Why, I was not expecting much, to be honest. I ended relations with that pitiful excuse of a captain a long time ago. Yeah, sure. But your wedding was literally yesterday. That's what I'm saying. Oh no. Does that mean that you and Space Husband are- <coughs> Hmm. He's Space Ex-Husband now for all I care. Wow. Ouch, that poor guy. You can't even- Isn't there like a, a- Like you have to legally be separated for like a year or so before you can even file for a divorce in reality, I think. Alas, my journey has gone full circle. It is more obvious to me now than ever that my perfect suitor does not exist. Don't say that, sweetheart. I'm sure your soulmate is out there somewhere. Oh, my sweet hero. Oh, great. Hero, why'd you have to say anything? How oh, I've longed for your voice. But no, I must refrain. I've already decided my path. Searching for a suitor is much too old-fashioned for me, so I've decided that we'll simply just make one. Gonna make one? What? Make a suitor? Is that even possible? By regular people means no, but a wealthy person such as myself does not abide by such rules. Yeah. I'm going to some place only filthy rich people like myself can afford to a family of sea witches that specialize in clients with special demands. Toodaloo, peasants. I'm late for my appointment. Oh my god. So, 
Should we follow her or what? Maybe? I feel like every time Sweetheart shows up, something bad happens. Fair. Yeah. When it comes to disaster, she's in a league of her own. Wow. Okay. Well, that was that. How can you cut traffic cones? That makes no sense to me. What the? Why are there... Why are there clams with... M oh, they're mussels. They're mussels. Okay, I get it. I get it. They're mussels. Why are we doing horribly against this? What? Maybe they're harder to fight. I don't know. This is unusual. Also, I probably need to go through the faux facts again. I'm passing to Amori because it, it makes Amori do good, really good damage. Oh, oh, that's good. That's good. It did damage. Oh, oh my gosh. If we just get, if we just get damage from it. That was interesting. We're going to go through the faux facts. I do want to get all of the enemies. Muscle. This is the one we just fought. A very muscular muscle. It keeps an incredibly strenuous workout regimen in order to maintain its rock solid physique. Amori. Okay. Oh look, Mr. Jawsome! A venture capitalist, entrepreneur, loan shark who owns 51% of the deep well. There is nothing he believes in more than a signed contract, Omori. Hey, it's the boss. Love that guy, Kel. Gator guy, the trusted and loyal henchman of Mr. Jawsome. It is highly likely that they have all signed questionable contracts with him. Yeah. They prefer to talk through their walkie-talkies even if they are on all in the same room. That's hilarious. Pluto expanded. The astonishingly glorious expanded version of Pluto, the strongest planet in all of the cosmos and in the universe. We love Pluto expanded. That was it for now. Is that a bunny that's a fish? That is a fish bun- it's a fish bunny. Look, it's a fish bunny. What in the heck is over there? Fish bunny. Bunny fish, fish bunny, fish bunny. It's a sad fish bunny. How much how much health can a fish bunny have? Not much. Stolen furniture and miscellaneous knickknacks. What? Blueprints for a two-story house? Why does it make that noise? What is this? Inner tube? Oh my gosh, I've never used that before. Two? Did you see him smile though? That was adorable. Oh, I got it, I got it. Yes. Well, that was it in here, I think. That wasn't much. Want to hear a joke about construction? I'm still working on it. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, you know, based on the fact that you can get jokes here and stuff, like, this is for an area we've already went to, so it seems like we will be able to go back. Okay, what's this? What? Where did he come from? I was like, why did that? Why can't I move? And then Snaily showed up? I thought Snaily died. What? I'm freaking out. Friends, it's good to see you. Lovely weather, isn't it? You look very strong, and I want to become strong, just like you. Will you help me train? Yes. I'll do my best. Excuse me. Wow, my first battle. Snaily is so cute. I'm so glad he got a revival. Here I come. I feel like it's not going to take much. Oh, look when he takes damage. It looks like he's not dead immediately, which is great. Battles are harder than they look. I gotta try harder. Um, you're a lot stronger than I thought you would be. I mean, to be fair, I wasn't doing much damage to him though before, so. Oh, he's sad. I don't know if I'm cut out for this. Stanley falls over. We're gonna attack him when he fell? Okay, please stop, that's enough. Wow, you really know your stuff. As a token of my gratitude, have this coffee. My friends gave it to me. I got coffee. I will not go into this dangerous looking cave to train my mind and body. The next time we meet, I will be much stronger. In every shonen anime. 
Alright, what is this dangerous cave you're talking about, Snaily? What? What is going? What is that? I'm very confused right now. Okay, number one, what is this? Are you here because you didn't want to pay the toll? You're the third group I've seen this week. Going all this way is kind of inconvenient, but at least you get to hold on to those sweet, sweet clams. You want to pay the last toll though, trust me. Well, another thing, I didn't even talk to the guy who like was at the little station or whatever, whatever that Sweetheart went to. Like, I didn't even talk to him. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Oh, now it's following me. What is that thing though? The thing that, are you running away from me? What are you doing? Oh my god, that is kind of disturbing. Reverse mermaid? I don't like that. This is really weird, to put it lightly, I guess. Uh, reverse mermaid, up giving in lies weakness, greatest hour. Our greatest weakness lies in giving up. Okay. Okay, shark fins. <laughs> oh. There's a sad shark, oh, they have little faces. There's a sad shark fin. Oh, I died. Imagine I say no. Of course I want to retry. That's the second time I've ever died in this game. Like, ever. I think the first one was the kite kid. I can barely see what, what's happening right now. This is like a maze. Follow the right wall. Dynamite, that's good. What? Don't look at me, I'm hideous. I can see that. Are you the one who's been putting weird faces in the wall? Should we go in here? Uh, musical clams in training. Please show them your support. Would you like to listen to musical clams? Yeah. These are so cute. These are adorable. It's like some of the different themes. I'm sorry, I'm just enjoying it. That's so pretty. That one was a bit interesting. It sounds like a ringtone. Okay, well, they're interesting. They're cute. That was in that was so that was cool. All right, let's see what's in here. I knew it was gonna be a cutscene. There's Snaily again. Whoa, what the heck? What the heck is going on? Here? Whoa, there's Sweetheart. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. She's flying with her umbrella. Right, that was it. Okay. What's down here? Um, wh oh, we're at a different a cool bite. Love yourself. Be kind to others. Skull crusher. Brick. I donate to charity. Respect your community. Alright. Hey! Wait, what is this? Oh, natural sea cow farm. No! Wait, those things are sea cows? I thought they were dogs. I did not know they were sea cows. Tapioca. The water here is a bit warmer than it is in the cave up in the mountains. Uh. Um... Oh my god, that scared me. I didn't know it was. What the hell is that? Squizzard. If you come up with the most interesting names, that's all I have to say. What does the squizzard do? Everyone feels. What the? Okay. That's what squizzard does. We got it. That was very interesting. <laughs> See how, uh, Moo? Oh man. Oh, there's a quest for this person. Sea Cow Farmer, okay. Hey there, partner. Around these parts, I'm known as the Sea Cow Farmer, but you can just call me Jim. This farm's been a family business that's been going on for generations, but the upkeep ain't so easy with the land being overrun by squizzards and all. Oh no, I'll tell you what, with all those dang squizzards running around, it's a miracle that this farm is still standing. I'm sorry, just talking in a country accent, like even a little bit, 
This makes me feel some type of way because I was surrounded by people who had a country accent growing up. I don't know how I don't. I mean, I mean, my parents didn't have a country accent, but I did hang around some of my friends who, who had a country accent and their family had a country accent. If only there was someone who could help me get rid of these darn squizzards, I'd pay anything. What about me? Hey, you know what? I just had a brilliant idea. If y'all don't mind getting rid of some slimy, stinky squizzards, I'd happily employ your services for some clams. I know it ain't much, but it's all I got. Can't have no peace here with all these darn squizzards running around. Wait, what's in here? Ah, oh, yes, a bucket of fresh and chunky sea cow milk. I don't know how that made me feel like new because that is so gross. So in other words, you want me to fight all of these? <sighs> We're gonna, oh my gosh, why is there a reverse mermaid here? We're gonna be here for a while. This gives us a lot of XP. I don't even need the clams. I just wanna finish it, you know? I wanna finish the quest. Guys, I have 20,000 clams. Like, I don't need clams. <laughs> I did it! I, I finished! I think... I think that was all of them. <laughs> it may have been useless to do this, because I have like over 20,000 clams, but I wanted to. Okay. Hey y'all, I've noticed lately that there are less squizzards causing trouble around these parts. You kids really are doing your fair share of work. Here's some clams for your efforts. Go on and get something nice for yourselves. Okay. 4,500. Okay. They respawn? Did I just do that for no reason? I don't know what to say. Oh, I must have left my smoke sticks at home again. Oh god. Um, hold on, I wanna go in here first. This is that cafe I was talking about, or, or whatever. Oh my gosh. Yeah, see? Hi, I'm Sadie or Sadie. My sisters and I started this cafe together, but since clams have been tight, a lot of my sisters decided to start working at the last resort. It's just me and my sister, Eleanor, left. What do you mean clams? They don't even pay them at the last resort. <sighs> I wish they would come back here. I would do anything to hear them sing again. All we can eat. Yeah. Aw, this is so cute. Wait, I just... Space boyfriends... Sorry, Space Boy is literally right there. To all those lost lovers out there, oh god. It's like the celebrities, or like, sorry, the singers who like make love songs and then break up like a week later and, and write a breakup song or whatever. Ariana. To all those lost lovers out there, this one is for you. Is he singing? Oh. Okay, well, what happens if I wait? Oh, the space pirates are entranced by their captain. Uh, should I have, like, talked to them before? All the tables here are sticky. Well, they sure don't clean, huh? Space boy, do you do anything other than sing? I don't think it's going to end. And I don't really want... I'm... I... I... No. Uh, Gonzo, this highway is longer than I thought it would be, but now it's going to be a walk back to the start, too. Might as well keep going. Oh, yeah, that's right. There was this whole thing. Snaily, hi. How are you? Friends, it's good to see you again. Lovely weather, isn't it? I have become much stronger since we, uh, <laughs> we last met. Will you help test my ability? Sure. I'll do my best. I'm sorry, guys. I'm doing so much extra stuff. Aw. I taught myself some skills since our last battle. You better watch out. Are you provoking me, Snaily? I don't want to be mean to you. I'm not going easy on you this time, Snaily. Wasn't that cool? I'm awesome. I can do a follow-up skills too. Watch this. Oh, that's cool. That's cute. Let's hear follow-up. He, he does the same stuff we do. That's funny. How was that? One of these days, I'll be as strong as you. He's happy! That's cute. Okay, please stop. That's enough. Sorry, Snaily. <laughs> Thanks, I feel much stronger now. I will not walk across this dangerous looking bridge to hone my skills to perfection. The next time we meet, I will be even stronger. Okay. Holy crap. I think the reverse mermaid is literally making my game lag, like, really bad. <laughs> are we supposed to be finding Basil? Like, what are we doing? Oh, 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 oh. I got past it. I got past the bridge, holy crap. 
Oh, Snaily. Oh my gosh, there's Mari. My mind and body are in perfect harmony. I've learned my ultimate skill. I think it deserves another test on your tree. Sure, I will fight Snaily. One more time. And then I will go see Mari. What the... I bet I'm almost as strong as you now. You better take this seriously. Well, it definitely looks different. You're about to be a toasted marshmallow, Snaily. Roasted. Alright, I'm not going easy on you. What the? He used an air horn? Well, now they're all angry. <laughs> you aren't the only ones who can use emotions. Alright, I see how it is, Snaily. Yeah, Snaily, I'm sorry. You wanted this. And now it's time for my ultimate skill, and what is that? This is kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty good. Even though you just slid us across the screen. I'm afraid it's over for you, Snaily. <gasps> Did we actually kill him? Did we kill Snaily? Unintentionally? I mean, I thought he was just gonna say, oh, you defeated me, oh, oh well. But he didn't! He died! I think we just killed Snaily, guys. Hey, Amori, it looks like we've reached the end of the road, literally. It looks like there's no long bridge up ahead. There's a long bridge up ahead. Oh. Whatever you do, don't look down. What do you mean? Picnic time. I can't believe we really made it all the way to the end of the highway. But you did, and you should all be proud. The bridge at the top of this cliff leads to a place called Deeper Well. The word is that Deeper Well has been around for a long time, but the bridge wasn't there until recently. Who knows what's on the other side? Do you think that's where Basil is? We don't know for sure, but there's only one way to find out. Where is the S key? Guys, we were supposed to be getting an S the S key. Oh, is it down here? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, thank God. Okay, because this seems- this is obviously important because we don't have S yet and there's S. Uh, it's welcome to black space, I think, from what I can remember. There's a hole. Two keys left. See, so, yeah, space is at the end. Now we need a W and a T. There's a hole here. Look into the hole. Please don't be any choices. <gasps> what was that? What was that? Why was he staring in the mirror like that? Does this kid have schizophrenia or something? And I've got chills. Urchin, please avoid my spikes at all costs. Thank you. This is the end of the highway. Oh. This is the end of the highway. That's it. Okay. I'm kind of nervous. What is that? Clear bridge stretches across the trench. Do you want to cross it? Sure. Okay, everyone's there. It's not just Omori again. This is very creepy. It's like little islands and stuff. <gasps> Whoa, what is this? This is trippy. Wow, just look at this place. There's so many cool plants around. I bet Basil would really like it here. Basil. He would have really liked it. Right, guys? Yeah. I'm sure he would have. Why is this so weird? I'm sorry for the lag again. Huh? What is it? Hey, I have a serious question. Do any of you remember what Basil looks like? Yes? Why do you ask that, hero? Let's see here. Basil Basil loves taking care of flowers and taking photos of his friends. He's warm, calm, and gentle. And even when he's upset, he'll always manage to smile. The rest is starting to get a little fuzzy. You don't remember what he looks like? It's okay. Me too, hero. Y'all are crazy. Why would? How could you forget your best friend? 
It's like I still miss him, but it's kind of hard to remember why. What? But that doesn't change anything, right? Even if our memories aren't as strong as they used to be, we still have to save him. Basil is our friend, and more importantly, he needs our help. You're right, Aubrey. I think we've all been apart from Basil for way too long. But I'm sure we'll find him, as long as we have Amori to keep us, keep us on track. Yeah, and you have to remember this isn't Amori's mind. So, for whatever reason, Basil is missing in Amori's mind, in his imaginary world. Why is he missing? Not only that, but some of these big plot points seem to be revolving around him. Like, he is the center of the bullying from Aubrey. He claims that Aubrey stole his photo album, and then some of the pictures are missing. But Aubrey says that he did something wrong, so I wonder, like, what was she talking about? What's her side of the story? And whenever we come around Basil, like, whenever... Whenever Sunny, I forget that that's actually Sunny, not Omori, my bad. Whenever Sunny goes around Basil and stuff, he acts all weird. And he's been acting weird, like really skittish and upset. And we had that little snippet where he was like, we're never going to make it out of here, Sunny. Like, or are we ever going to make it out of here? Or something like that. And we know that him and Sunny are really close. So why is it that he's missing here? What is happened to Mari? What is going on? All this time, Basil has been waiting for us. He could be lost, lonely, or scared. I bet he could use a big hug right now. Then when we're all together again, we should all give him a big old hug, huh? Aw, it's nice to see you two getting along for a change. I could hug the both of you right now. <laughs> Cute. Huh? Me and Kel? Get along? What are you talking about, Hero? Stop being weird. Haha. <laughs> Relax, you two. I'm just playing around. Hold on, Basil. We're almost there. We'll all be together soon. I hope. Oh! That was a pad of teleportation, apparently. What in the world? is all this stuff. We are in the Little Mermaid, except weirder and kind of trippier. Whoa, this is so weird. Blank, your memories are not free. To gain a memory, another must be sh shrouded. And yet, all memories will eventually fade. Perhaps you've already noticed the curse of the deeper well. Oh, your memories get taken away here? That is a weird looking creature. Oh, that's a... Oh, that's a creature, okay. When trouble shows itself, there is always the choice to run. But one day, you may very well find yourself running alone. Yikes. Um, hold on. What was in the other, the other area? Oh my gosh, is that a person? What if it's up to you? What if it's only up to you? Carry on, dreamer. You are the only one who can. Right. It is selfish to dream for so long when there are those who are expecting you okay time will always move forward eventually the truth will become clear you know this well don't you dreamer they're referring to sunny i'm assuming as he's the dreamer he's the creator of the world okay we can go in this area now cypher the sun shined brighter when she was here well that's a very clear reference i'm assuming that means Mari, like the sunshine brighter when Mari was here. Oh, we're in water now. This is very long. Oh, look, there's hands on the wall. I think they look like hands. Hands seem to be a reoccurring theme here, you know. Oh, well, that was Basil. A shadow of Basil, anyway. I don't know why it's always a shadow. Branch coral. Oh my gosh. A long time has passed since you have ventured this far. Deeper layers of this world open up as the dreamer grows more desperate. Even imagination is limited. True. You have questions that I can answer. Answers that you have forgotten. I will lay them out for you. What? If you are curious, you will choose. Big yellow cat, white space. We have to choose? We, can we can we choose all of them? 
My lost friend. You would like to know more about your lost friend. It's not going to give us another choice. Let's see, we kind of know that ugh, why I don't know about the big yellow cat at all. I mean, yes, because that seems to be a big problem is the lost friend. I don't know about the big yellow cat. And white space is kind of easier to understand than those things. The friend you have lost is not in this world. The day he was removed, he was reborn elsewhere. He is special to you. A string of fate ties you two together. He cannot leave that place alone. To retrieve him, you will have to remove yourself as well, but in a way that is natural for this world, for headspace. Okay, this journey is nearing its end. You already know what you have to do, Dreamer. Is there anything else you would like to know more about? Yeah! We can choose all of them! Thank God! Okay, so they're saying that you can't find Basil in this world, which, go figure. But, I mean, yeah. I mean, you can only live here for so long. Yeah, he's gonna have to, it seems like he's gonna have to face something if he if he talks to Basil again, because it looks like they've been separated. Even though they used to be really close, that's what I was saying. The big yellow cat. You would like to know more about the big yellow cat? Yes. Before this world was created, there existed three great creatures. The oldest, the wisest, and the favorite. The oldest is alive, but not the same as he once was. Age has removed his conscience. And he has evolved into a parasite within himself. What? He lives here just beyond this cavern. The wisest, against her reason, committed an act to oppose the dreamer's will. It is an act that is not even known to me. As a result, she was stripped of her wisdom and banished to isolation. A special presence somewhere deep, deep down. The last and favorite... The big yellow cat was chosen to watch over the dreamer's most precious room. He remains the dreamer's favorite even to this day, watching diligently, waiting for something to happen. Honestly, I can't put into words what I'm thinking, but that one's not as easy to, to decipher, so I'm just not going to say anything for now. White space. Yeah. To be in white space is to be nothing. White space is emptiness, a home without warmth, a place to survive but not to live. Even still, your conscience cannot be erased. It will always find a way in. Even in white space, it will take the form, and if one wills it, something will be formed to subdue it. A hanging black light bulb, the repression of an idea. Yes, perhaps it is time to admit that you are human, dreamer. You have listened well. I have granted you knowledge, but know that I can also grant you power here. There is a challenge that will aid you greatly in this world. It is simple without thought. And if you succeed, I will be gone as well. I offer you this sacrifice. Will you take this opportunity? Yes. I understand. Stand very still, dreamer. There's red. Okay, well that's creepy. Okay. The apple. A red juicy apple hangs from this tree. Uh, that looks like Sunny's head. <laughs> Would you like to eat the apple? Sure. I have no idea what this is representing. What? It looked like Sunny's head. Because it showed a 50 heart and 50 juice. Okay. Um, because it looked like a head. Oh, wow. It was very creepy. The branch of coral is not alive. It died. So, the big yellow cat, I don't know who the oldest, who the wisest, and I know who the favorite is, it's the big yellow cat, but the oldest might be a, uh, sorry, Sunny 
the wisest might be Mari or maybe sorry the music's weird um the wisest could be Aubrey or Mari it seems like Mari though more so I don't know about the oldest though I don't know about the oldest and and the wisest so like I'm not really sure it says that I had to go back and review for the oldest, but the wisest it said that she went against the dreamer's will. So in other words, against Sunny's will. I don't know what that means, but okay. Okay, what is this? Okay. Oh, this is very big. This has very interesting music, to say the least. What is that? Oh, I thought those were enemies. I guess not. They make a weird noise. Mute. An unhallowed burden has been placed upon you. You have the power to change the future. What will you do, dreamer? What will you do? What the hell? Let's just get to weirder and weirder. Okay, it looks like I can only go here. So I will go there. Oh no, just a picnic basket. That's a little scary. There's a whale? There's a whale. Whale, hello there, friends. The name is Humphrey. What brings you here to my humble little cave? Oh, hello, Humphrey. We're just looking for someone. Sorry if we're bothering you. You're not gonna find him. So what is this even gonna be about now? Um, I guess exploring Sunny's mind. Maybe we'll find out what the hell happened. Oh no, not at all, children. I do love visitors. In fact, you were the second group to visit me today. Who's the first? The first was just a girl, a very loud girl with a big red bow. Okay, sweetheart. Doesn't that sound like someone we know? Huh? Is Sweetheart here? Where is she? Hmm, where is she? Where is she? It's on the tip of my tongue. That's a joke. It is. Okay, she is inside me, you see? She's inside you? Why, yes, yeah, she is visiting my guests, for I am also a home to a family of sea witches. Oh. We spend our time together chatting and chuckling. It is so fun to hear about their daily antics. Sometimes they are even kind as to bring me my meals. What are your meals? It's much easier for them, you see, for they are closer to my belly than I am. In fact, I'm sure they love even more visitors. Hey there, let me lower the bridge for you. My apologies, the first guest seemed to have been causing some indigestion. That's weird. Um, okay. My head. Humphrey. Wasn't that nice. Whoa, Humphrey's belly is huge. It sure is easy to get lost in here. I bet if I yell, it'd make an echo. <laughs> echo, echo, echo. Ah, oh, where'd you come from? Welcome to my lair. Ugh. You are surprised to see me? I am always here. I am inside me and all around you. I'm everywhere. Oh god. This got so much weirder. Or am I just here? Wow, that's so cool, Humphrey. I wish I could do that. Why do I find this so suspicious? It's kind of gross if you ask me. That's what I'm saying. Wow, so rude. Hmm, there are many ways to go. Where should we start? Left, right, up, around. Does it matter? It's all forward, isn't it? Just pick one, it's easy. Not really. Especially not for someone who's indecisive. Oh! That's cute. Hi, I'm from for your all-access pass to Humphrey, aka Slime Girl's Lair. Strictly speaking, I guess I'm what you humans call an elevator. Unfortunately, we can only take one appointment at a time, so you have to wait your turn, though. 
If you can find me a slimy key card, I might be able to pull some strings for you. Okay, let's go right first. Oh, what is... Can we get off? No. This is some interesting music for something so gross and weird. What if we run into... Oh, it's a... Ugh! It's not bubble! A snot bubble? I'm... <sighs> this is definitely a trip. I was not expecting- Oh, I was not expecting any of this. A dubious concoction, probably best left untouched. Hey, check this out, humans. Did you know Humphreys are strong enough to withstand a waterfall's current? Watch this. Yikes, except for that guy, I guess. Oh well, just a natural sele just natural selection working. Hey, you know what? I just had an idea. I bet if we gather enough Humphreys, then maybe we could use them to form a bridge to the other side. Hey, I was supposed to say that. We need to gather Humphreys now. Oh my gosh, it's it's Mari again. Now, Amore, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, wow, sis, this is a weird place to set up a picnic. Well, let me tell you, it may be recommended to only set up picnics in normal places, like in the forest or campsites, but what's the fun in that? This is not the first time you set up a picnic in a weird place. What if I want to study the anatomy of a whale while I eat? Then what? Expand your mind, Omori. I need to set an example for my sometimes boring little brother. Okay. Do you want to have a picnic? Yes. Mari, this gelatin is delicious. What is it made out of? I'm not sure, Kel. I've just been scooping it off the walls and floor. Do you like it? You what? <laughs> just kidding. I made it by mixing fruit and, um, gelatin. Gelatin. Why am I calling it gelatin? Gelatin. It's gelatin. Okay, yeah, but what's gelatin made out of? Well, Kel, gel gelatin. Gelatin is made out of gelatin. <laughs> I see. Well, whatever. Food is food, I guess. Mm hmm. All right, guys. I took a break. I hope that I I was looking through some of the footage, and I hope that I changed enough settings to where my microphone isn't too bad right now. Because it was a little like harsh the uh, transitions between just not talking and talking. If you could tell, I'll probably put a disclaimer at the beginning of the video. But yeah. Anyways, hopefully these settings are better. But I'm still experimenting. So please. Be patient with me. We're in a whale. Mr. Bird? Question mark? What? Field work in progress. Do not disturb. Okay. What if I want to disturb, though? Gosh, the music is still so weird. Hey, there's a Humphrey. Humphrey. We Humphrey and Medusa's sector pride ourselves in being the best of the best. Okay, scientists? Colorful potions and flasks of all shapes and sizes. There's another Humphrey. Hey, Humphrey, do you want to join your friend Humphrey at the waterfall? <laughs> I'm going to- I have a feeling I'm going to be saying Humphrey a lot. Of course I will. I thought you'd never ask. Right. Medusa treats us well and feeds us regularly. You can't say the same about Marina or Molly or those other sea witches. Biology is my worst subject, but that's never stopped me. All the Humphrey from Marina's sector keep disappearing, so she keeps asking Medusa for more. Mm, I hope I'm not next. Also, I apologize in this section of the video if you hear any background noise, like, as far as people talking and stuff, because a lot of people are about to come over, but I don't have a choice but to record this right now if I want to post it, so. Oh my. Oh my. Oh, can we talk to that one? It's weird. Just poking out of nowhere. Um, what is that? What? Okay, I don't know what I was expecting, but I thought it was just going to be a normal watermelon, but apparently not. I think we have a shirt attached to the- as a sail. Like, what the heck? <laughs> I literally sneeze at least once every video. Uh, it's in a laboratory or something. What in a whale It's not going to make sense, Robin. <laughs> wow, look at all these cool plants here. Yeah, something Basil might like if he were here. Hmm. Basil. Basil? What's the name of this plant here? Yeah, basil is a plant. Oh, it's so cute! It kind of reminds me of something. Really, y'all? I think we already went over the, the fact that they're losing their memory, though. But I can't remember what. Oh my gosh, a bunny. A slime bunny? 
I say that Medusa's experiment has a 14 times 7 plus 44 divided by 11 minus 2% chance of success. I'm not even gonna do that now. Flying bunnies. Mumbo jumbo, what? <laughs> Books filled with knowledge in a language you cannot read, okay. Alright, watch your step. Some of these spilled liquids aren't meant to be touched by humans. Nice. According to my calculations, reading makes you smart. Oh, well, yes, my greatest masterpiece. Right. Oh my gosh, we have enough Humphreys now. Oh. Oh, it's one of those. I guess we could find it. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, that's what I thought was going to happen the last time, but that didn't happen. Okay, this... What? Oh my gosh, we have to avoid it. Why is there random food? It's trying to kill me. What in the... What is that? Big Molio. I am Big Molio. In return for finding me, I bless you with great fortune. What? And what would that be? Fun? Snaily? Oh my gosh, Snaily! I'm reading a book about air conditioning. It's very informative. Right. A lot of hard work goes into keeping my physique. Yeah, I can see that. You know what I'm just crazy about? Air conditioning. Ain't it the greatest? Okay. Snaily, what a nice looking pool. Oh no. Don't. It's not a pool. Did he know it was not a pool? Does Snaily have lore? That was so sad. But I feel like I know he w what he was doing. He didn't even show his face. Unless he was just being stupid. We can't go there either. Oh, we can go down here though. What the? Oh, okay, this is a little game. Um, all my friends left me behind to go build a bridge, but I'm gonna show them up by building an even bigger bridge. If you see any Humphreys floating around, just be sure to send them my way. How many do we need? Whoa! Okay. We have to go through multiple times. Append- I got an appendix? Ugh. I would really appreciate it if you guys could wrap this up pretty soon. No rush, I just think I'm getting kind of sick. Motion sick. Sorry, hero. I'm trying, okay. Oh, I got the last two, thank god. Out of curiosity, I wonder what would happen if you got Hangman. All right, we have enough Humphreys now, I think. All right, let's go. Medusa and her sister have been researching the world for centuries. These books are the fruits of their labor. No matter how many times I do this experiment, it never turns out how it's supposed to. I guess it's time to refer back to the manual. Okay. Hmm, listen to them having fun up there. Those part-timers got it easy. Who are you talking about? Alright. Oh my gosh, I guess this is Medusa. Sweetheart, sweetheart's in here. My, it smells absolutely horrendous in here. How much longer is this going to take? My nose is quite sensitive, you know. You can't just barge into someone's laboratory and start telling them what to do. That's not how it works. You will get used to the smell. Now hush, doll. I am working. And it is done. Is she going to make a clone of herself or something? That looks like a little pod. I remember her wanting to marry herself. So making a clone of herself actually might make sense. Ugh, finally. Hello, my perfect suitor. Wake up. Don't touch the glass, you buffoon. You'll ruin the experiment. Well, I never. I was right. You think? You saw the little heart in the glass? Uh, where did it go? What happened? Oh, she's got special powers. My word. This experiment has turned out greater than I even expected. Okay. Take a look, doll. The results are absolutely perfect. This is like a Marvel movie. 
behold an absolutely perfect version of yourself. Hmm. I don't like her. Of course you don't. You don't like anybody. What did you say? Have I heard you correctly? But she has everything that you asked for and more. Oh, you simpleton. There's nothing more perfect than me, but I see that you do not understand that. Seems like she's a narcissist. You are nothing more than a hack. This was a humongous waste of my time. Sweetheart, I don't know if you should be talking to them like that. I mean, this witch or whatever was powerful enough and smart enough to create a whole clone of you that flies and looks powerful. I don't know if I would be trash talking her, okay? I'm storming off. Oh, I've had enough of your nonsense, client or not. You've really struck my last nerve. See what I mean? Who taught you to run your mouth like that? Now, if you'll excuse me, this is a waste of my precious energy. I have much more important matters to attend to. Don't you dare walk off first. I'm the one who is supposed to storm off. And now we're just... We're just left watching? What is this? It's a vent? Oh. Okay, we're still on the move for the slimy key card. Actually, let's go left. I don't know why, I just want to go to the left first. Oh my. They're just sitting there watching me. That's really creepy. <laughs> okay, we can teleport. That's great. Molly. Oh, hello, Marina. Are you here to steal my things again? Well, not this time. I've prepared something extra special for you today. As you know, I'm a very busy person, but alas, you are my sister. I will grant you access to my room. But we're not your sister. If you are able to solve my little gift, I hope to see you soon, darling. If you're still alive, that is... Okay. So, we might die. Was that just a recording of her? Uh, type puzzle, theme, memorization, difficulty, hard. Do you want to activate this puzzle? You cannot choose another puzzle until it is solved. No. Okay. Puzzle time, apparently. Oh my gosh. A floating mirror. Again, I love how the backgrounds change. You guys, we can't relax now. We have a puzzle to solve. Aren't you guys afraid the bomb is going to explode? It's a bomb? Just relax, Aubrey. We got this. The room's full of the smartest people I know. That doesn't make me feel better at all. The lady on the screen said she set it up for his sister, right? They just assumed it was a bomb. She wouldn't really let it explode on her sister. I don't know, Cal. Aubrey is right. We're in unfamiliar territory. It's probably better to play it safe. What do you think we should do, Mari? Huh? Oh. I think you should do what your heart tells you. Of course. Thanks, Mari. I can always count on you. You're welcome. Wonderful advice. Okay. What are the rest of these puzzles? Puzzle multiple choice medium. No. We'll start with the easiest. Yeah. Let's activate it. Um. Okay. The blue one's open now. Let's go over here. Oh my goodness, okay. According to our test, it would seem that sprout moles grow from tofu. Who knew? I'm not surprised. Oh, what's this? What did we just do? Apparently nothing. We understand so little about this world, so we study it, yet our research just fills us with even more questions. Accurate. It's an endless and fruitless cycle. So if I multiply the results, subtract by infinity, then divide by zero, and carry the one, that would bring me to an imaginary number. Imaginary numbers are actually, they're actually a thing. Nuclear, nuclear waste? They aren't. Sprout Mo, I can't believe I signed up for this. Okay, he signed up for it. Good. Greetings, visitors. Would you like to see something cool? This machine here can perform remote teleportation. Oh, here's the puzzle. With the power of modern technology, I can send the sprout mold to the other side of the grid. Take a look. What an error. 
Someone must have messed with the program. Oh, it was probably Molly again. She always puts puts in stunts like this. Okay. That's number one. An unfinished bag of potato chips. Why would you have chips lying around when there's nuclear waste right beside you? Hey there, visitors. I've been leading an experiment on Humphrey through Humphrey movement. Are you ready, gang? Let's do it. Like we've practiced. Oh my gosh. They are so creepy. Okay, two is bottom middle. Huh? What are you looking at me like that for? Can't you see I'm busy? Right, doing what? Actually, I just got an idea. On second thought, can one of you kids try running through these metal plates for me? I just want to test something. Why don't you discuss it amongst yourselves and vote? What? But I haven't had to use Aubrey's at all here, so... Huh? Me? Okay, but I don't have a good feeling about this. Me neither. Oh. Okay, what now? I'm done. Oh. I knew one of these spikes was broken. Thanks for volunteering for, ris for risking your life. Okay. Okay. Three is right middle. Top middle. Oh, hello, visitors. After months upon months of hard work and toil, I've successfully created the first Humphrey hologram machine. Do they look like the real thing? I couldn't be more proud. And that was the end of it. Yeah, that that's pretty easy to remember. You can do this. We got your back. Oh my gosh, her. Great. We got the first puzzle. I mean, what happens if we do it wrong, though? Puzzle solved. Okay, let's do the medium one. Then. Multiple choice. Yeah, I do want to activate it. There's just a computer. All right, I get it. We have to find a password. Kind of like we had that code word for sweethearts, like castle. What the... Oh my gosh, what is that? Why? Ugh, I don't like it. Some kind of worm. It looks like a leech. Worm bot? It's a robot? Oh, that was not hard at all. <laughs> oh my gosh, more of those machines. Okay. I know that we're gonna need Hero for this. Hey, it's these guys again. Work your magic, Hero. Greetings, sir, conveyor bot. My companions and I require assistance in changing the direction of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please aid us? Oh my goodness. Nice person. <laughs> Get lost? Huh, that's strange. That worked so well before. Don't be so down here. He's probably just got his gears all mixed up or something. Could you say that any louder? Now he's going to get even more mad at us. Hey, scraphead. You'll turn those belts around for us, won't you? Rude person. Just like Molly. Oh, that's why he listens. Okay. I can't believe that worked. Well, what do you know? Looks like I'm pretty good at this charm thing, too. I don't know about that. This looks like a job for Aubrey. That's a key. That's a key. Oh my god, that's a key. Is that a W key? Oh my god, it's one of those where I can't see it. Oh my gosh, how am I supposed to know? It looks like a W or a V or a Y. Hold on, we can just look at the description. This is a V, I think. In the gut of a whale. In the gut of a whale or captured in a steel trap. Because this is a steel trap. We aren't going to get Hangman, though. I think it's a V, but I don't know. It is V. Damn. <laughs> I knew it, and I still did it. But it's all right. We're not going to get Hangman. It's all right. Huh? Okay, they're powerful. More powerful than I thought they were. Whoa, where are we at now? And look, the camera's taking live footage of us. Look at them. Say cheese. Aw, we look so cute. Almost makes you wish we had a camera. Oh, uh, don't worry. We have loads of pictures of us, don't we? We have pictures of us? Where? Oh my gosh, this is sad. But this isn't Amori's mind. He's the one playing the story out, so. But only when we least expect it. Aw. What are you talking about, Cal? Something special about everyone living their own lives. Um, you're being kind of weird. No, he's not. You're being weird. Huh? Hmm. Uh, never mind. It's probably nothing. Let's keep moving forward. We gotta figure out the solution to these puzzles. That bomb could blow at any second. 
Jeez. Humphrey! Humphrey! It's a good thing I checked before writing this M, or else I would have almost written another B. That would have been pretty bad, huh? Oh, okay. Molly told us to write letters on our back and stand in this order. At least I think this was the order. So O, B. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to switch places. The one on your right. And when I say you're right, I mean you, as in the person standing in front of me, not some hypothetical observer watching us from behind the behind a screen. Wow. Breaking the fourth wall. So maybe B O? Oh, boom. It's a good thing I checked before writing them. Okay. Oh my god, that makes sense now. Uh, boob. I love Molly. Wow. I wonder what happens if we put in the wrong one. Memorization. Hard. Do you want to activate this puzzle? Yes. Sure. That's the last one. Oh no. Wire? Oh no. What is that? Let's just go in here first. This is what it said to do. Two. Three. Interesting. Ah, finally, a room without a waterfall. This bright white light is perfect for my summer tan. Uh, I did not get anything out of that. Oh, okay, let's pay attention to the background here. So we have blue, green, red, blue, green, red, white. Okay, blue, green, red, and white. Oh, the other ones have represented the numbers. I finished it. That was not hard. <laughs> to save oh my gosh is that molly oh there sweetheart is again how long is this going to take i don't have all day she's gonna be in all of these Ugh, they're gonna hate her like i know i would oh look at the screen it's like a brain my work takes patience stop talking darling i need to concentrate seems like she would make something like an android or like a i don't know like an artificial intelligence Atel intelligence. <laughs> How about now? Almost done, darling. And finished. At last. Is this another cloning thing? My greatest invention is complete. Oh. Now speak. Speak, my beautiful robot. The robot. Robo heart. Okay. I wonder if there was any message in that. Oh, well, that doesn't sound right. Something must be off of the code. It's because you made me rush my work. Instead of to love, it must now be programmed to kill. Uh... Hmm. Don't blame this on me. She's your robot. Thanks to you, my hopes of finding true love have been shattered. Oh my gosh. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. My, what a handful. Uh, she's not my problem now. Uh, but the robot is. Oh, I bet Humphrey's gonna love that. Oh, I almost forgot. That girl. She owes me payment. Uh-oh. I must catch her before she leaves. She better be paying her dues. I have to go the other way. I have to go forward now. Um, this looks interesting. Oh my. Well, this isn't suspicious at all. This is making me nervous. There's a sprout mole in there. What is a sprout mole doing doing in there? What the heck? Intelligent growth. Well, conveniently transformed into a bridge after being smashed. Oh! Why does it look like that? There's like cages everywhere. Um... The receptionist Humphrey, welcome. Marina is not currently seeing anyone right now, but if you are enjoying the ex exhibit, feel free to crawl into a cage and wait for the next available experiment. You will know when the screaming stops. Right. Oh, uh, what the? Oh my gosh. I am Marina's first experiment. 
She made me out of sand and fruit when she was just a baby. What would you like to do? Pet? You should do a cartwheel. Um, what concerns me is the meat. The meat and the saws and the, and the oh, and the dead plant and the... This does not look humane, but what do I expect? I am Marina's second experiment. She made me out of clay and rocks when she was just a baby. What would you like to do? Poking is cool, but I like high fives better. Um... What is that? Sprout mole question mark? Alright, well that was interesting. Oh, what is that? Okay, it's happy. It's a mouse. Lab rat. Nice. Tools for research. Research. Oh my gosh, you see that Humphrey and the- why are they so creepy? I am Marina's third experiment. She made me out of a rubber glove when she was just a toddler. Hi, Mari, again. Dang, what happened here? This place is a huge mess. Experiments. All the furniture looks really dusty. It's probably been like this for a while. Looks like it used to be an office or something. Wasn't this supposed to be a layer full of sea witches? None of this stuff looks witchy at all. I mean, we are basing this off of Sweetheart's sources. I don't know if I would trust Sweetheart, much less her sources. <laughs> Fair enough. We gotta stop Sweetheart. She's definitely up to no good. Obviously. We do? I mean, we can always mind our own business. Hero's got a great mindset. <laughs> Oh, is that what we're doing now? Protecting the world from evil? How fun. What does protecting the world from evil have to do with Sweetheart? Have you met her? She is evil. Fair point. <laughs> well, I guess someone's got to do it. Oh, I didn't even realize you could hit it from down there. Applefly? I'm Marina's fourth experiment. She made me out of dirty apples when she was just a child. Ugh. What would you like to do? Oh? Okay, enough. Did you guys hear that? That was freaking weird, though. Yeah, it seems like these experiments are getting more elaborate or, um... I don't know what the right word is for it, but just weirder more inhumane probably i am marina's fifth experiment she made me out of cardboard and candy when she was just a child it's like it's like a, a pinata oh my candies oh my god plans for a failed experiment peeve i am marina's sixth experiment she made me out of balloons and magic when she was just a teenager Uh, whoops. <laughs> Is that an eyeball? What the heck? I am Marina's seventh experiment, though the numbers do get muddy at this point. She made me out of birds when she was just a teenager. Um, I am Mari's eighth experiment, probably. She made me out of moss and bean sprouts when she was just a teenager. Uh, okay. All right. <laughs> Ooh. What's that? I'm a little... S oh my god. What is that? What is this? What is that? Hey, that's his flower crown. What is his flower crown doing here? Oh no. All the flowers are... What did it say? Bruised up or something? It, it looks kind of familiar. I wonder who this belongs to. Do you think we should try to return it to them? This flower crown is pr in pretty bad condition. I don't think anyone would want something like that. Yeah, maybe you're right. No. What? Cal, what did you do that for? It's fine. You heard what Hero said. No one would want something as bruised up as that. But it used to belong to someone. Kicking it off a cliff is just mean. That's what I'm saying. Huh? Why? Flowers grow back anyway, don't they? All right, calm down, you two. Kel, apologize to Aubrey. Fine, sorry, Aubrey. 
Apology not accepted. Oh my gosh. I can't believe they just did that. But this, this is only Omori's mind. I wonder how Omori feels about Basil. Like, why? Why? Sorry, Sunny, not Omori. I keep forgetting. Um, okay. We're going further. Uh... Okay. What the heck is that? It's like a little maze. What? That's the yellow cat! Marina's 667th experiment. Caution, do not poke the glass. Okay, I won't poke the glass. That was kind of scary, though. Not gonna- what? It's gonna be chasing us? Are you kidding me? <gasps> okay, horror game. Oh god, I better not get myself in a corner. Okay, this turned into a serious horror game. What? Are you kidding me? What am I supposed to do? Okay, I need to go down there first. Holy crap. When it flickered, I genuinely flinched. No, 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 go, go, go. Oh my god, I don't know what that does. I like this spot. Okay. Okay, I needed to come away. I need to go away. Oh my gosh, why is it so dark? Go, 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 go. Oh my god. I wanna get this. Ah, hard string. Oh my god, that's scary. No more no, 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 juice. I think we did it in time. Okay, it's right there. Oh my god, oh my god. Cool! Is it gonna keep following me? What is it doing? Why can't we move? My duty has been fulfilled. This game is so fucking random. Is it because I found him? What if I didn't find him? What would we have? Would oh my gosh? Would we have had to fight that thing? There's a slimy key card. Oh, this place is disgusting. What exactly is it that you do here? That's not your business, lady. Just sit back and relax. Mm. I feel nauseous. Then why are you even here? Uh, oops. Well, that'll do, I guess. Oh, no. <laughs> She's like Frankenstein. She's like doing Frankenstein experiments. Alright, it's done. Here you go, lady. One perfect suitor coming right up. Oh, my. Say hello to your new soulmate. Oh, no. Mutant heart. Is this some kind of joke? What do you take me for? I am ten times, no, a hundred times more beautiful than this thing. What do you expect? You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. Hey, wait, what? What the heck? You can't just storm off, lady. Where's my money? Oh my god, the music stopped abruptly. You kind of sign me key card. What do you know? Oh. Hmm. My, my, what's all this commotion? There must be some fun activities going on downstairs. Do you want to give... Yeah. Oh, a slimy key card. Oh my gosh. Yum, yum. So, did you want to go downstairs now? Yes. I thought we were going upstairs, not downstairs. But okay. Yeah, downstairs makes sense. Oh, wait, you mean you said commotion was going on downstairs. Oh, no. Are we about to fight a boss? Because, I mean, just look at this. Okay. Oh, it's so quiet. Why is it so quiet? Oh, 
Oh, what do you know, sweetheart? Oh my gosh. Stop right there. You can't leave just yet, doll. We just want our payment, darling. Can't you see how upset Marina is getting? Where's my money, lady? Give me my money. Oh yeah, she's very, very angry. It's sweetheart and those witches. Sea witches, I meant. <laughs> There's no way we're getting caught in the middle of this. Let's make a run for it. Stop right where you are, children. I must correct you, as you are sorely mistaken. We are not witches, but followers of silence. Silence. Science. It's a common mistake, I'm afraid. Humans tend to fear what they cannot understand. Besides, I think I know why people think we're witches. Hey, what are you looking at me for? That aside, we have a bigger problem on our hands. That's right. Where do you think you're going, sweetheart? You owe us a big, big bag of clams. Uh-oh. Hmm, as if three peasants are worthy of payment, sweetheart. Are you just poor? Like, are you not admitting it? Just pay them. All I wanted was for you to make me a perfect match, but you've all managed to fail me in three different ways. If you're so insistent to get your worthless clams, let these children cover the charge. <gasps> you wouldn't. Where do you think you're going? Humphrey, stop her now. Um. Yoo-hoo, I am here to report that Sweetheart has been disposed of. It's a good thing you asked. I was afraid that I wasn't going to be able to hold myself back any longer. Also, this may or may not surprise you, but Sweetheart had a total balance of zero clams on her. Zero. Not a single one. Which is quite unfortunate, as I am getting a bit hungry. That wench double-crossed us. I knew there was something fishy about her. Hmm, well, not necessarily. And guess what? It's gonna be up to us now. I can actually- I could probably pay it. I have a lot of clams. She did say these children recover the charges. Oh yeah, huh. In that case, she's definitely paid her due. Which part of them should we sell off first? Don't be such a brute, Marina. She is a brute. I'm sure she meant the kids would pay us, not that we should sell them. Alright, darlings. Now be good and hand over your big, big bag of clams. Huh? S so, uh, yeah, about that. Just curious, how much does she owe you anyway? Oh, uh, let's see here. Probably a ridiculous amount. There's consultation fee, initial fee, setup fee, inspection fee, service fee, cost of materials, warranty fee, disposal fee, shipping and handling, gratuity, cancellation fee, damages, late payment fee. So that brings us to the total charge of about 1 million clams. 1 million clams? We don't have that kind of money. Yeah, we don't. Oh. Well, at least we get to see them out of their pixel form, I think. Well, that's just too bad. Humphrey, seal the exits. Oh my. Tough luck, kids. You walked into the wrong whale. Someone's gotta pay for all of this. I would say, desperate times call for desperate measures. Wouldn't you agree, sisters? Sisters. Oh, this one is too pretty to sell, isn't he, Molly? Oh my gosh. This is messed up. Well, I quite like this one. It would make a great pet. Oh my god. Don't you touch him. Let us go now. We didn't do anything wrong. Oh, feisty. I think you'd like this one, Marina. <laughs> well, I guess selling just one will do. Kel? Hey, let me go! If you kids can't pay us in clams, you can pay us with your arms and legs. Kel, no! Let go of me! Put me down! Aww. Oh, he's scared. I don't blame him for being scared. But what the heck? He bit me! Well, what do you expect? Oh, settle down, Marina. It's just a little nibble. <laughs> You'll pay for this brat. Well now, it seems that you've gotten Marina all worked up. Our little prey is biting back. Guys, it looks like we're going to have to fight our way out of this place. I thought that was obvious. Oh, it's a fight you want, is it? 
Oh god. It's been a while since my last hunt. <laughs> okay, they're gonna make this dramatic. Yes, it seems like our prey needs to be disciplined. Someone needs to teach you children some proper manners. What about you? For prey, you're all way too picky. You don't want to be sold. You don't want to be pet. You all should really learn your place. Well, whatever. That's fine with us. There's always another option. If you're going to keep resisting, you leave us with no other choice. I'm afraid we'll just have to. Turn you into chum instead. Okay. Way to fan service your way through this. Fan service! Fan service! Okay, what sh how should we start this? 69. Wow. Chainsaw! He pulled out a chainsaw. Hmm. You kids are more resilient than expected. You know what that means. It's time to get serious. Oh, I'm having so much fun. Okay. They become angry. Hey, Medusa, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, sister. I think it's about time we switch things up. Just relax, children. This won't hurt a little. This won't hurt a bit. Sorry. Whoa, what? What just happened? Oh my gosh. Wait, what happened? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is chaotic. Well, I don't know what just happened. Oh my gosh. Wow, that does great damage. Uh huh? All oh, their juice is gone. Oh. I see how it is. <gasps> okay. Yes. Really synergy. Yes. This is for I think I don't know if this is the first time I've used this in a boss fight. No, it's not the first time I used it in a boss fight, but still. Oh my gosh, yes. We got We got them with the an attack! You kids are a lot tougher than you look. This is much more trouble than it's worth. What a predicament. How will we feed Humphrey now? I don't know, but not by defeating me. <laughs> that was awesome. <sighs> Man, what's wrong with us? This fight should be a piece of cake. Forget hunting. I'm not cut out for this kind of nonsense anymore. I'm just going to stick to research from now on. Well, dolls, it seems we are all past our prime. If only we were 200 years younger. Right. Uh-oh. Not to alarm you all, but I'm afraid my appetite is getting much, much, much bigger. Literally me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Humphrey, we got you. Molly, feed Humphrey some clams. Huh? I'm sure I fed him last time. Besides, I used up all my clams on software for the last job. Uh-oh. I'm getting hungrier. Okay, fine then. How about you, Medusa? Well, I, I wasn't expecting to feed Humphrey again so soon, if memory serves me correct correctly. Isn't it your turn to feed him, Marina? Oh, wait, is it? Oh, God. I thought it was Molly's, Molly's turn. I'm pretty sure it was Medusa's turn this time. Well, 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 it seems you have all run into a bit of a pickle. If you can't feed me, I guess I'll just have to help myself. Uh-oh. No, my furniture! Oh gosh. What are we gonna do? Humphrey's gonna digest everything. Perhaps we should plan an escape? Uh... We've already expended so much energy. Perhaps it's finally time for us to swim with the fishes. Oh my gosh. What about us? Yahoo! Yoo-hoo! Oh my god. Right. Because this gets dark. Seafood. Delicious. Humphrey is out of control. How are we going to get out of here? Keep calm, everyone. Looks like, let's look for an exit. We're looking for an exit. Um. Uh, oh. My friends, may I see you all look delicious right now? Humphrey, stop this. Have you eaten enough? We promise we'll feed you later, but you can feed me now. Just let me eat you. Uh, time to feast, time to feast, time for you to be deceased. 
Oh my god. Please don't eat us, Humphrey. We don't want to be eaten. Well, it's a little too late for that, isn't it? You should have thought about that before you walked into my mouth. Um, it's no good, guys. I don't know if there's a way out of here. Don't say that, hero. Yeah, we can't let it in like this. Uh, are we gonna have to fight Humphrey? Oh, there's no need to struggle, children. Then again, it is always more satisfying when you prepare your own food. Now, you all just sit still. The preparations have already been made. Dinner is being served, and you're on the menu. Oh, time to feast. Oh my gosh, I can't even think. Oh my gosh, he's really hard. Can we even fight him? The final fight has just begun, but can you win if we work as one? Humphrey Grande. <laughs> Whoa, that did a lot of damage. Just a warning, it's about to get smelly. It's time for you all to get in my belly. Are you sure? Oh god. Oh, Kel's toast. Oh. It doesn't matter how quick or slow, the more you struggle, the deeper you'll go. Oh my gosh, again? Is there any... Is there any killing this- this thing? Like, am I doing this for no reason? Just relax, there's nothing to fear. Hey, Amori, is it getting stuffy in here? Again, he swallows everyone. We can meet is very fun. Should you be rare, medium rare, medium, or well done? It seems like it's getting darker. Does it seem like it's getting darker? It's pointless to squirm give up, my friend. I'm afraid this cycle will never end. Apparently. Oh, it's so nice seeing this. I love seeing Sunny Sunny smile. Or Mori, it's Sunny. There's no need to squirm ignorance is bliss. How many times must we do this? I don't know. However many times it takes for you to kill me, I guess. Feel free to struggle, because no matter what, you'll never be able to escape my gut. Whoa! Ugh. Oh. It's no use. How will we get out of here if Humphrey keeps swallowing us? Amori, I'm scared. Why did we get ourselves into this mess? Don't worry, Aubrey. We'll get through this. We've gotten out of plenty sticky si sticky situations before. Yeah, we can't give up now. There's just gotta be a way out of here. Does this happen whether you fight him or not? Ooh. Going somewhere? Oh my gosh. Hey, he'll never defeat me, loser. Oh. Is it because he was almost dead to begin with? Um. Oh. Oh my gosh, we're actually being, uns like, thrown up, I guess. It's actually getting brighter. It was getting darker. Oh my gosh. Hey, the keys! There's the W and the T! Bleh. Well, that didn't go as smoothly at all. There's the W and the T! Suddenly, I feel so sleepy. I think I'll talk. I'll take a short nap. Oh my gosh. The W and the T. What happens when we get all the keys? That was a close one. Yeah, I never underestimate a hungry stomach. That was really scary. But you know what? At least we got through it together. So what do you guys want to do now? What? I'm not sure. Weren't we looking for something? Wait, didn't Hero mention this before? Yeah, we were just following Sweetheart, but... That situation seemed to have resolved itself. Yeah. No, I'm pretty sure that was something else. Aubrey, you're always worrying about nothing. I don't even know what to say at this point. Come on, you should learn to relax and just enjoy yourself sometime. I guess that's true. I am a little tired of worrying so much. 
What happens when we get all the keys? Because we're about to get all the keys. These are the last two we need. One key left. Um, okay, eyeball. Oh god, I'm scared. Oh god, I'm scared. Zero keys left. Well, welcome to Black Space. Okay. What is going on? Okay, this is Basil's house in the imaginary world. It fell through. The eyeball again! What is the eyeball? What does the eyeball mean? Oh. So it showed Basil's house. Basil's obviously important. There's a hole here. Go into the hole. I mean, yes. Is it, this is the last hole, right? Or is this the last hole? I'm terrified right now. I'm so nervous. What? Oh god. Okay. Stay away. You are not my son. So, is that his dad? Is that Sonny's dad? He's cutting down a tree with... Um... Did Amari... Commit suicide? Because that looks like a rope not just a rope but i don't know how much i'm allowed to say on youtube why why won't you fall i can't do anything okay so i think that may have been sunny's dad or something i don't know but i just wonder what happened to mari you know, like I said, what is this? What the heck is this? Oh my gosh. Here we are again. Oh my god. You have come again to seek the truth. Each time your adventure may be disparate, but as your journey nears its end, it will always lead you back here. The truth. The truth is always the same. The path to the truth was once here, but it has been removed. It was moved to a lighthouse in a pier, then to a library banished deep underground, and after that to an old barn on a distant planet. And this time it will be in the heart of the vast forest. So Basil's house? Is that what you're telling me? We need to go to Basil's house? No matter how many times the path is concealed, the flower boy will always find it. And your dear sister Mari, she will always guide you to it. Even as hollow shells, they will continue to evolve, and each time they will grow wings and fly too close to the sun. It is their nature. They are the only ones who know. And one has carried it with her to the grave. Oh! So Sunny and ba Basil know something then. So Basil has something to do with this? Like, like directly? Death may be no danger here, but the memories to them do not fade so easily. Many times your friends have met with an unfortunate fate. Although they are revived time and again, the most haunting stay in this world, even if their bones remain. 
the longest ones sink here to the bottom of a deep well and become nothing you have forsaken them yet they still yearn for your care their souls know nothing but how to scream for help do you take pity on them what your dear sister mari with a bad knee you could not bear for her to die again so she was given the safety of a picnic blanket yet it is her nature to leave and to protect and when she does, she will leave you again and be born anew with the undying soul that you have cursed with her. Okay, so it's kind of explaining what everything means in this world, I guess. The truth about what's happening. The souls assigned to your friends, they are fragile and must be protected, and so they must remain asleep. Yet, the path to the truth is closer to your most precious room than ever before. They mentioned the precious room before, so that must be either the one we saw the yellow cat in, which it, I think it mentioned, or the white space. Will you be able to bury it this time? Perhaps it is too late for you. No, I don't think it's too late. Don't say that. Oh, there's the, there's the window again. We saw the curtains in the window when Mari, like at the beginning of the last episode, I think. You know the keys to the other realm. They are different each time, but they will unlock the same door. The end of this journey will lead to suffering, but if you do not face this, you cannot continue. This form, though it has not shown its true self, is evil. You will not see that unless you fight it. When your intentions become hazy, they will transpire into this world like a thick fog. You will know when it happens. It has already happened before. At that time, return to where the truth was reborn, to the heart of the forest, and like each time before it, attempt to rewrite your fate. Will you be doomed to repeat this cycle over and over, or will you break it? Explore this world while you can, Dreamer, until there is nothing left. Oh, there's the eye again. Okay, we know. The keys. Did I accidentally press that? No. That was not accidental. It's a portal? Okay, hold on. Can, you g can we go back? I think it's giving us a chance to finish everything. Okay, I think this is giving us a chance to finish what we started. Alright. That will be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please let me know what you think about it in the comments. Holy crap. Like, I have no idea even what to say about all of that. I might, like, after interpreting it and processing it, might say more in the next episode when we go to finish everything, I guess, in this world. I think that's what it's letting us do because I was freaking out about it. But yeah, I guess we'll find out in the next episode. But I hope you're all having a great day, great night whenever you're watching this. And yeah, we'll see you next time.